Are you afraid of organic chemistry? Do you feel that your organic chemistry is weaker compared to other subjects? If yes, then you're watching the right video. After watching this video, you won't be scared of organic chemistry anymore. Before we begin, let me share my journey with organic chemistry, how long I've been studying it, and a bit of background. My name is Dr. Yuvraj Patil. I completed my PhD in organic chemistry from IIT Indore. After that, I conducted research for several years in foreign countries like the USA, France and Japan. I pursued my master's in organic chemistry in 2014, and my chemistry journey started back in 2008-09 with my bachelor's. So, let's get started without wasting time. Point number one. Organic chemistry is a volatile chemistry. Just like certain solvents evaporate, such as chloroform, when left open, the concepts of organic chemistry tend to evaporate from our minds after a few days. The best way to handle this is practice, practice and practice. Point number two. Don't underestimate the power of basics. If you're in the higher grade and haven't studied lower grade organic properly and thinking of working hard and making organic strong in the higher grade will be a big mistake. Organic chemistry is taught sequentially and understanding the basics, especially the lower grade GOC, General Organic Chemistry chapter, will greatly help you understand organic chemistry. Point number three. Understand the concepts properly for the first time. Whenever you study organic chemistry, understand the concepts thoroughly the first time, especially reaction mechanisms. Point number four. Revise with closed book notebook copies. The biggest problem is that we study organic chemistry. We know everything, but when we try to recall it the next day without looking at our notes, we can't remember any reactions or concepts. Therefore, revise by closing your notes and books. Discuss reaction mechanisms with friends. Point number five. Practice as many previous year questions, PYQs, as you can. The more PYQs you solve, the clearer your concepts become and your confidence increases. Point number six. Divide and rule organic chemistry. Whenever you study organic chemistry, don't study too much at once. What happens is that if you study many reactions or reagents at once, confusion begins. Divide your study into parts. Point number seven. Stay consistent with your organic chemistry studies. Consistency is key when dealing with organic chemistry. Regular practice and revision will reinforce your understanding, making it less likely for concepts to fade away. Establish a study routine that allows for steady progress and you'll find organic chemistry becoming more manageable and less intimidating over time. I hope these points will help you understand organic chemistry better. Thanks for watching this video. See you in the next video. Please support me by subscribing my channel.